We believe one of the best ways to deliver long-term total shareholder returns is to play in categories where meaningful growth exists. Within those categories, then, we seek to do two things with our portfolio. One, organically grow our brands and bring growth to the categories in which they sit. And two, make bold transformative moves to bring new assets and new growth into our portfolio, as well as divest businesses that are not contributing to sustained value creation. Our strategy has the consumer squarely in the center of everything we do. As consumer behaviors change, so too must our portfolio. We continually look to evolve our portfolio and position a greater percentage of the portfolio in higher growth categories, those categories where the consumer is or is going. Part of that journey also entails exiting categories that no longer align with this vision. Our portfolio evolution is an ongoing journey, a constant dialogue we have as a leadership team, so you'll never really hear us say, we're done. That said, we expect the specific portfolio reshape we initiated in our fiscal year 21 in our pet and consumer foods businesses to be largely addressed by the end of our fiscal year 22. Recent portfolio activity has provided several benefits to date. We have strengthened our long-term growth potential by divesting businesses that had consistently challenged top-line revenues. In addition, we are providing greater focus on and support behind the brands that do drive our performance and future growth. This portfolio reshape is about driving focus to our highest growth opportunities and preparing our organization for future acquisitions either bolt-on acquisitions in current categories or more transformative moves into new categories or new capabilities.